hope you're doing well today. Um, today's project has to do with drawing alterations. So basically what I want you to do is look for a picture in a magazine such as something like this, uh, specifically something that has a person or people in it, you know, something that you could actually work with because what you're going to do is you're going to alter the way this picture started out from. So here's one I'm going to work with. I thought this was a cool one, but I just wanted to show you what I did. So I started off with this beautiful picture and then I cut it in half over here and then I gave her a whole new look. <laughs> so I want you to change the way the picture started into something um, better, something much more fun to look at, um, colorful. You can change it any way you want. So I still kept the eye and the eyebrow, of course, and the uh, you know the other half of the nose and the mouth, but I totally changed it up, and I actually love the way it looks right now. So I'm gonna show you how to do this. All right, here we go. So this is the picture that I have chosen. And I thought it would be um, cool to get rid of this part, okay, of the picture. But I'm gonna keep her and I'm gonna keep the remainder of the um, landscape. I thought that was pretty neat. So let's do that. When you're cutting things out, specifically if you're going to cut around an object or a person, please make sure you get close enough to that object. You don't want to leave too much of the surrounding background. All right, so next step is for me, I'm going to change the sky part of this um, image. So I'm going to take my piece of paper. It does not, this does not have to be on the entire piece of white paper like this. Unless you want it to, that's totally fine. But I just want to keep it about like that because I want to work with the sky and make it um, really full, really colorful, full of details and stuff like that. So what I'm going to do is basically just tape it down. And I'd like for you to, if you do the taping, um, tape it from the back. It's a lot easier. Is what we have so far and now I'm gonna add the detail here we go actually I just wanted to let you know that I I did cut off the edges okay and you can do that if you want to or um, you can just leave them the way they were originally okay let's move on So I made a really silly 
um, background for this picture. But that's the point. It's to um, really alter it, change it up, add anything you want to it. The next step is basically... The next step, sorry about that, is basically coloring it in. And you can use crayons, markers, colored pencils, blend. Um, nothing has to look realistic at all. If you wanted your clouds to be all rainbow colors, then go ahead and do that. Um, so have fun with the coloring and I'm gonna work on mine. So, here is my um, artwork that I totally altered and I used markers and crayons and colored pencils and I think it came out pretty, pretty good. Alright, I'm looking forward to seeing your altered artwork. Take care everyone, have fun! I just wanted to share another tip um, when you're doing this. Now you don't have to um, cut your paper out horizontal or just vertical. You can cut your paper at an angle if you need to and decide whether or not you're going to draw the bottom half or the top half. Okay. And I did something a little different with this one. You can draw on it. You can cut it a little bit differently with some more movement and for example I would draw this part here okay because look what I did to the other half of the magazine I kind of change it up like that and you can do that just have fun with this be creative don't be afraid to try something different all right have fun everybody